brace yourself. Heads are about to turn. This is not a half step, and there is no turning back. We're taking a hard right into new territory. Some might say a luxury sedan isn't in Kia's wheelhouse. We say to hell with that. We're serving up twin turbo all wheel drive performance and going in a new direction that is not for everyone. This is pure dynamic substance without excess. It's nimble, precise, agile, gorgeous, seductive. We say why, we say why not. This is a mind bender that crushes all assumptions. No further doubt, no second guessing. You'll have no words except, damn. This is the new Kia K900. gentlemen I give you the most refined and most advanced and best driving luxury car ever from Kia you heard Assad talking about the Stinger and the K900 in the same sentence and there is a good reason for this second generation we are making an even bigger statement about where Kia is today and where we are going in the future so we adopted the Stinger's twin turbo powertrain and pushed the wheels to the corners. A longer wheelbase allowed us to create a look of classic elegance with balanced proportions and tension surfaces. The team was inspired by a concept that we call gravity of prestige. For me, this idea leads to a design that is a grand gesture, a vehicle of impact. Because we spend so much time in our cars, the Kia design team put a special effort into crafting a harmonious interior, a harmonious interior environment that is a distinct highlight, and might I say, delight of the, of the new K900. Like a finely crafted piece of modern furniture, the K900 interior offers a simple, contemporary, and above all, comfortable space that is even larger than its, in, in its predecessor. There is a minimalism to the look and feel with just the right amount of tasteful accents. We also collaborated with the Pantone Color Institute to develop a unique ambient lighting system with seven settings to produce a distinct state of mind, feeling and mood. Think of it as a chromotherapy. On the road, the K900 looks agile nimble and well-balanced, and I can tell you it is. Having driven the car, I can tell you with my full confidence that Albert Biermann and his teams have worked their stinger magic into the K900 driving experience. Stately and sophisticated, the K900 with its gravity of prestige brings a new definition of luxury into the Kia portfolio. And now, here's Saad to tell you more. Thank you, Peter. Yeah, thank you. Gravity of prestige. Oh, I like that. If you think of it, this is all about grounded luxury. The K900 has evolved into a much more sophisticated machine and is ready to go head to head against the best. But where does that confidence come from? To start with, as Peter's mentioned, we packed it with Stinger's 3.3 V6 and its fast spooling turbos and we coupled it with an eight-speed automatic transmission and even paddle shifting. And oh yes, standard, it also comes with full-time all-wheel drive with dynamic torque vectoring. And like Stinger, we expect the K900's traction and handling to outperform Audi and BMW again. But again, you may ask, where does that confidence come from? Well, we think when Albert Bierman was our head engineering, uh, 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 a, uh, the chief of engineering for our company, pulls the special engineering team together. Good things happen, especially with ride and handling. And here's what I mean. We're talking about strengthened chassis with ultra high strength steel. 
more hot stamping than any other Kia. Use of structural adhesives. 33% increase in torsional rigidity. Re-engineered front and rear multi-link suspension. And the result is a perfect 50-50 weight distribution. Wait, there's also more. A perfect balance comes with also perfect comfort. And here's a first. The K900 is now available with electronically controlled suspension. And you may ask, what about responsiveness? It's now got a new rack-mounted variable ratio steering standard. What about its power of stopping? Well, the all-new K900 now also comes with quad piston front brake calipers and features brake fade compensation. Heck, the brakes will even dry themselves when too much water is detected. And the result is a level of confidence and control you've never seen from Kia before. Except the Stinger, of course. All right, let's get inside of this car. Folks, this is a first-class cabin that lacks for nothing. And let's start with technology. We're talking about a huge 10-inch heads-up display, 12.3-inch he uh, high-definition touchscreen, premium navigation system accessible via UVO telematic system with maps and trip information, climate controls, Apple CarPlay, and Android Auto. And here's one of my favorites, a Harman Kardon Lexicon 900-watt premium sound system with 17 speakers Best of Kia. Now let's talk about seats. We're talking about 20-way power driver seat, 16-way power front passenger seat, and in the back, 14-way adjustable rear seats with independent climate controls and wireless phone charging. And as you expect, materials pamper this K900 with natural woods and super soft Napa leather everywhere. And even there is a custom analog Maurice Lacroix clock in the dash. How did I do that? Is that, is that good luxury? Good luxury. <laughs> in summary, folks, the K900 continues to be a new take on luxury vehicles, just as we did on a new take on performance with Stinger. <laughs> Thank you.